Prophet Suleiman was coming, approaching uh, an ant hill with his army. And the ants, they got scared. And so one of them yelled out, Ants, go into your home so that Suleiman and his army doesn't crush us and kill us and not even feel it. And Prophet Suleiman had a gift from Allah that he could speak to animals and he could understand them. And so he smiled and he made this dua. He said, Rabbi awzi'ani an ashkura ni'mataka allati an'amta alayya wa ala walidayy wa an a'mala salihan tardah wa adkhilni bi rahmatika fi ibadika salihin. It's such a beautiful dua. He smiles, it says in the verse that the Prophet Sulaiman smiled alayhi salam. And then he made this dua where he thanked Allah for this blessing. And not only that, he said, Rabbi awzi'ni an ashkura ni'mataka allati an'amta alayya. Awzi'ni means remind me or bring me to be grateful to you. Ash-shukr huwa hafidhun na'mah. Being thankful is the thing that um, preserves the blessing. So something like your health, being thankful for that. Your home, your family. A lot of things we used to make da'a and ask Allah for those things. And now that we have them, we don't thank him for them. It's a beautiful reminder when Prophet Sulaiman made this da'a. He said, Awzi'ni an ashkura ni'mataka allati an'amta alay. This blessing that you have given to me. And he's asking Allah, this is the Prophet السلام, He's asking Allah that with this blessing, he can do good that pleases Allah. A lot of times we have blessings, we have a lot of good things, but do we put it in the way of Allah, the one who actually gave it to us? Do we invest it back into our religion? And so it's a beautiful dua that Prophet Sulaiman says. I'll say it again slowly. Rabbi awzi'ni an ashkura. نعمتك التي أنعمت علي وعلى والدي وأن أعمل صالحا ترضاه وأدخلني برحمتك في عبادك الصالحين آمين 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 Share this video with someone who can benefit from it and follow for more